Yep. Reason I have Buzz here today is that the teaser trailer for White Year just came out today. And we're gonna do a trailer reaction. So, yeah. So, before we get started in the reaction, I just want to say that in case you don't know, which I'm pretty sure you do, I am a freaking fan of the four Toy Story movies. And... And note, White Year isn't a Toy Story movie. Well, it's Toy Story we waited. It's just the human version of Buzz, of what the toy in Toy Story is based off of. So, yeah. Why not we get into the reaction okay when I discovered this trailer just this morning at school I pretty much lost my mind but I figured why not I give you my reaction Okay, so let's watch the trailer. Okay, status. Booster. Go. Anything? Go. Fido? Go. Guide? Go. Fight. Cabin pressurization is underway. As we prepare for ignition. Flight recorders are on. T minus five. Summer 2022. When he rolled that last clip, because I, because they cut off the sentence. Okay, there's a few sh things that I need to say. The animation kind of reminds me as Wally, which is another film made by Pixar. And it kind of also looked like an animated Star Wars movie. And, and another thing is, Tim Allen is not voicing Buzz in this. Instead, they got Chris Evans, who is known as Captain America.
I was quite surprised to find out when they announced it. You know, I'm not saying Chris Evans does a terrible job. It's just I kind of preferred Tim Allen. I mean, Tim Allen was in Toy Story 1, 2, 3, and 4. And was, I guess maybe Tim Allen decided not to sign up for this. So they decided to get Chris Evans. And I want to learn more about these new characters. Like, there's the girl. I believe that's Buzz's love interest. When I saw it, I was like, oh boy, Jesse is, isn't going to be happy. Well, I mean, this is the human version of Buzz. So... In this movie, there's going to be no Woody, no Bullseye, no Jesse, Bo P Peep, or Wex, or Swinky Dog. It's the only Toy Story character in this movie is Buzz. Okay, sorry, my camera just caught me off. For a second. Okay. As I was saying. I think I what I said what I need to say. About Buzz being the only. Toy Story character. In. The. Movie. This is just Buzz's movie. Like I said earlier, this is not a Toy Story movie, but however, it's related to Toy Story. Because Buzz Lightyear is in it. And there's... No way to put it that I am so freaking excited. I'm beyond excited. But you know, Buzz is my favorite character from the Toy Story movies. He made his First appearance in the first movie back in 1995. And, and I'm also very excited for the Buzz Lightyear action figures coming out. I think there's one coming from Mattel that is just Toy Story. It is... A karate chop action buzz. I'm looking forward to that. And they, I think they're also coming up. With a pretty close. Movie accurate. Woody. Because. I can tell by that. He has. A close mouth smile. With, his, with a straight. Eyebrow. And he has. 20 things. If you pull his. Pull string. And what I saw from today. I grew up. The string is yellow. It should be white. And no I'm not being racist. It's just. Not accurate to the film. That's all.
Mm -hmm. And I can't even tell if his hat can come off or not. But I'm excited to see those toys. And most importantly, I'm excited for White Ear. The mumba of merchandise is going to get. I want to see more variants of Buzz. New Buzz Lightyear toys since Toy Story 4. I did not expect to see him on... I'm, I'm definitely going to see this movie. And I am wasn't even expecting to plan to since what after from... After what happened when Toy Story 4. But. This isn't Toy Story 5. It's just a. Prequel. To. Well. Toy Story. But, there's another movie coming out before that, and that is called Turning Red. I will see this one, but White Year is the one I'm more anticipated to see. Since, you know me, I'm a f massive fan of... The entire Toy Story movies, including the fourth one, which some Toy Story fans did not like the fourth one. Because, maybe because of the ending. Well, I love the fourth one, but I'll say my favorite Toy Story film is, I'll have to say, the second one. It's, I think it had a pretty good plot. The fourth one is my second favorite. My third favorite is the first. And my least favorite is the third. It's just, don't get me wrong. I love all four movies. And, and it does seem like Toy Story or Pixar in general can disappoint me. Yep. Like, seriously, I want to see another good Pixar film. Something as good as Coco. Okay, so... Yeah. I'm so looking forward to this movie. Okay, so... Yeah. I'll see you in the next video. And to infinity and beyond.